Welcome to one of the spiciest places on earth. 20 minute burn. Welcome to one of the spiciest places on earth, Avery Island, Louisiana, home of Tabasco. We have our tickets, we have our official badges, they even give you these teeny tiny little Tabasco jars, and now we're off to take the tour and learn how Tabasco is made. It smells so good in here. This is fitting for our upcoming Mexico trip because the Tabasco pepper first appeared in Mexico, although its exact origin is still unknown. And the Mexican Indian origin of the word Tabasco means land where the soil is humid. And it's definitely humid in here. Every pepper is selected based upon it matching a color stick that is exactly the right ripeness color of a Tabasco pepper. And you can buy those here, which is even cooler. Right, so if you grow your own Tabasco peppers at home, <laughs> you can make sure that they are ripe and ready. Up to the standards. What's really cool about Avery Island is that the McElhaney family still owns and operates it. They're the original family who started Tabasco. It's really cool to see in one site the entire process from beginning to end. They start by picking the peppers, then they add salt, mash them up, and then store them in barrels. And they put a layer of salt on top of the barrel to protect the mash from impurities. The barrels on the ground are only about a month old, but if you look in the stacks, some of these are already three years old. The 2017 barrels will be ready this year. After the mash is done aging, only a McElhaney family member can test the heat level of that mash to see if it's ready to go on to the next step, which is super cool. They have official taste testers who are part of the family. Something to note for our fellow RVers, they have plenty of RV parking. You can see our little home over there. So if you have a big rig, don't worry about getting here. You'll fit. Guys, I wish that we had smell vision right now because it smells so good in this building. So once the mash is approved and it's been aged up to three years, it then comes here into this building where it is blended with high quality distilled vinegar and periodically stirred for up to three weeks and the result is Tabasco original hot sauce. Before the sauce can go over to the bottling room, the seeds and skins have to be removed and then it's sent to the lab for a series of very rigorous tests. They're looking for quality, consistency, color, and heat level. And a panel of experts also evaluates the sauce. Only after it passes all of those things is it sent to bottling. All Tabasco is bottled here on the island, and this batch is going to England. You can't stop at the Tabasco factory without coming to their restaurant and filling up on delicious Louisiana cuisine. We usually get a sampler platter, so we have the corn mock choy, crawfish at a fish, 
minute burn. <laughs> and you just okay. need the very tip. I got of the it. Crust. No, I got it. I'm 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 doing the tip. All right, just, just a tip, tip. Just a tip. That's plenty. This is plenty. No burn? It's it's hot. I wouldn't call it like no. With that much bread, I think it's fine. another year. <laughs> so if you're ever driving along Interstate 10 heading out of New Orleans, make sure you stop on Avery Island for Tabasco. And get the family reserve. Stuff is delicious. <laughs> it's really, really good. We're gonna go pour it on everything now. <laughs> Shameless plug time. If you like hot sauce, dogs, Mexico, us, be sure to like, subscribe, click the bell for notifications, and share it with your friends. Yeah, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.